Today we will have revision on topic hydraulic motion. Let's try an example. Given is the question for our tutorial today. From the question, we have conditions of 20 kg lab experimental equipment, omega 2000 rpm, y equal to 0.25 mm, and s double dot 4 m squared second. The question will want us to find equation of motion transmissibility ratio minimum frequency ratio maximum natural frequency and accelerator stiffness here are the illustrated diagram for the question here are some terms we should understand xt is displacement of mass yt is displacement of base x minus y is net elongation of the spring x dot minus y dot is relative velocity between two ends of the damper from general location equation of damper system we need to find net amplitude value x minus y apply the explained terms into general location and we have this equation rearrange and we have this equation we know that yt is equal to y sin omega t xt is equal to x cos omega t after first derivative in terms of t y omega cos omega t and x dot t negative x cos omega t apply to the earlier equation and we have this equation by assuming c omega y is a sin alpha and negative ky is a cos alpha apply it to L equation and we have this equation by triangle identity and we have this equation where a is a is and alpha is at fixed base The general equation is equal to F O sin omega t. We know that x t is equal to x t c and x t plus x t p. And x t p for at fixed space is this. But at an uneven surface, we have x t p is equal to this equation. where A is to find transmissibility ratio given from the question is this values we know that omega y is velocity amplitude maximum Omega squared y is acceleration amplitude maximum. Formula for transmissibility ratio, force, and x. Apply formula. We need to find the force first by F equal to ma. And we have 80 Newton force. Insert the value into the x formula and we have the value of x insert x value into the transmissibility ratio formula and we have the value for transmissibility ratio to find the frequency ratio we have two equation two condition of r less than one and more than one this is formula for r less than one apply value of transmissibility ratio and we have this value this is this value is very minimum that it is not valid apply 
formula for r more than 1 and we have this valid value of r to find maximum natural frequency and accelerator stiffness we know that r is equal to r omega over omega n omega n is natural frequency k is accelerator stiffness r is equal to 1.3196 apply to the formula and we have the value of natural frequency use formula to force maximum derivation to get k this is the formula we erase the formula until we use k as the subject apply the values obtained from the given and the calculation and we have the value of k if we have new damping ratio with zeta value is equal to 0 0.1 we need to find new value of x using this formula this is the formula we arrange so that x become the subject insert the values from the question and we have this new value of x new acceleration is the value of omega squared and new x and we have the new acceleration tutorial is done thank you